Everton are close to signing Asmir Begovic again. Uh, the big goalkeeper was at Goodison Park a couple of years ago. He spent last season at Queen's Park Rangers. He has left there in the summer, is available on a free transfer. He'll come in as Everton's number third, uh, number three goalkeeper. Um, a little bit of a mad one, I suppose. But then on the other hand, obviously, Andy Lonergan left Everton in the summer. I think he's gone off to Wigan. So there was that vacancy for an experienced number three at Goodison Park. And Sean Dyche has chosen Asmir Begovic as the person to fill that role. Fabrizio Romano has given us the old, here we go today. So Begovic will be announced shortly, I imagine, as a re-signing for Everton. Uh, Everton have rejected a bid today from Marseille for striker Neil Mopai. Marseille wanted to take the forward on loan um, with an option to buy at the end of the season. Everton have rejected that because they'd rather sell the player now or at least have an obligation to buy at the end of the deal. It's complicated being a loan because it means that Everton would have to offer Neil Mopai another contract or another 12-month like sort of extension to then be able to sell him, of course, next summer. So um, the Blues want a better deal than what's being put forward. There are two other clubs in the mix for the striker who spent last season on loan at Brentford. Everton have reportedly made an offer for Atletico Mineiro midfield player Alison Santana, who plays in Brazil. The 18-year-old has a £51.2 million release clause in his contract. The report that is coming out of Brazil today, reported by Premier League Brazil, says that Everton's offer is way below that. Of course it is. Uh, there's no chance we could offer that for a player. Um, yeah, I'd, I'd file this one under Fanciful. Maybe it'd be great if it was real, as in we should be looking in that market, not at the price quoted by uh, these. But I don't see this one being a real thing right now. Hopefully I'm wrong and Everton do bring a couple out of South America and we can get them in. But this one seems a little bit far-fetched. But as always on the Daily News, we will report what is doing the rounds here. Evan have also been linked with Scott McTominay today from Manchester United. And that one seems unlikely right now as well. And finally, young Irish striker Braden Graham made an excellent start to life as an Everton player. He scored a goal and created the other goal as Everton under-18s beat Stoke City 2-1. He did make his debut for Linfield when he was just 15 years old. He is now the ripe old age of 16. Uh, but what a good start he's made to his Everton career. And uh, hopefully it's the first of many that uh, he makes it into the first team and bangs them in there as well because we could do with some strikers coming through who know where the net is. That is it for the news daily. Give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. See you later.